Hey YouTube, my name is Indiera and welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to talk to you guys about what it's like being in a 900 division. So I'm going to just start off by saying that I loved being in a 900 division and I was very happy that I was chosen to be in it. Um, so 900 divisions, I'm going to just be I'm just be the honest with truth with y'all. If you're in a 900 division, they look at you like you're smarter. And I say this because like anywhere we went, like, say if our division, like, messed up or we were being bad or something, you would hear the instructors be like, you guys are not 100 division. You guys are supposed to be better than everybody else, and you guys are supposed to be smarter and blah, 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 blah. I guess because, you know, you can play an extra instrument or you have an extra set of skills. They expect you to be able to pick things up faster, and they expect you to be better already. So, it was so fun. So, every, was it every Saturday? Every week. Yeah, every Saturday, we would go to the drill hall and practice. So I was in choir. Um, so for us, it was choir, band, and drill. In drill, they do like the rifles, like flipping the rifles and stuff. So I was in choir. So every Saturday in the morning, we would go to the drill hall. And the drill hall is where you graduate. And we would go practice. So I would practice choir. If you were in band, you would go practice with the band chief. And if you were in drill, you would go practice with the drill chief. And I was with the choir chief. Chief Miller, y'all, he's so awesome. Man, if you are a singer, you're gonna love Chief Miller. He's like awesome. I was in ship two. So if you are a 900 division, 900 division, you're gonna be in ship two. And ship two is literally right across from Freedom Hall, which means that we have the shortest marching distances. Like if you're in like ship 12, ship 14, ship 11, it takes them forever to get to like anywhere because they're so far. But we're so close. We're literally across the street from Freedom Hall. So when it's time for PT, it's so easy. We just march across the street. So, I like that. I feel like we were lucky because we didn't have to march as far. Especially when it came to firefighting. Oh my gosh. If y'all know about firefighting, y'all know that the firefighting building is the farthest building. Like, if you're in ship 12 or ship 11 or ship 14, whatever, I feel so bad for you. Because firefighting was far from, from me, from ship 2. So, if you're from ship 12, I can imagine that walk was, like, a pain. But, yeah. So, we, like, we're right there in, like, the closest ship. Um... Yeah, everyone, like, if you look on the map, it says Ship 2, Special Ship, or Special Barracks. I thought that was cool. I don't know. So, yeah, so they look at you to be smarter, and then you're going to be performing for the graduation. So, for us, we performed for the two divisions ahead of us. So, for 900 divisions, it'll be, like, all the 100s, and then it'll be one 900 division per week that graduates. So, it'll be, like, 100, 100, whatever, 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 and then 900. Next week, 100, 100, 100, 100, 900. So there's always going to be one 900 group that's going to graduate a week. So it was really cool. We, we performed for the two graduations before us, and then we performed at our own graduation. So I think that was cool. Oh, my gosh. That was so, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to be honest with y'all. That was so hard because the first graduation we performed at, I liked it. Because I was like, oh, you know, oh, shit, we're going to graduate soon. This is cool. This is what it looks like. The parents are all happy and excited to see their uh, their sailors and stuff like that. The second one was a pain. Oh, my gosh. Because at that point, you're ready to leave. Like, you're like, okay, I'm ready to go. Like, I'm still here. Why am I still here? I'm performing, but I'm not leaving. But then when it came to ours, I was so happy. I was, like, ready to dip. I was so happy to graduate. We had some great RDCs. Like, our RDCs were, were on top of their stuff. Like, they was not playing no games. We had really good RDCs. So, I think that's a good thing. You get – you they make sure you get good RDCs. Like, ones that really care and are really happy to do their job, you get those. So it was awesome. I remember, like, I always hear a lot of rumors about 900 divisions not getting beat. That's not true because we got beat a lot. We, we we got beat a lot. So the whole 900 division don't get beat is not true. Okay, so this is, I'm going to tell you, this is, a, like, a really good pro about being in 900 division. So normally, um, like, for regular, I was talking to, like, people here, so... I guess in their divisions, like the regular rifle divisions, they would, um, so you have like a big compartment and it's like one side, like one half is supposed to be for your division and another, the other half is supposed to be for like another division. But for us, it wasn't like that because they have, they had brother divs. That was like you shared with your brother div, but 900 divisions didn't have a brother div. We had baby divs. So for us, we would have, basically we would only sleep on one half of the compartment and the other half would be empty because... It was supposed to be like for our baby div, like it was just empty, and you don't get a you don't get a baby div until like the week you graduate. 
So for us, we like literally had a whole huge compartment to ourselves. And we were only sleeping on half of it. And the other half was empty. So that means that it was only, what, like roughly 30, 32 girls sharing that big head. And then on same thing on the guy side, it was like around 32, 40 guys sharing the heads. But normally in rifle divisions, you're going to, like, rifle divisions get brother divs. So instead of being just 30 girls sharing the whole compartment, it would be 65 girls sharing the entire compartment and sharing the heads for rifle divisions. But 900 divisions, we got the luxury of having an entire compartment to ourselves. And it's crazy because I didn't learn that until I got to A school. And so they would tell me, like, oh, like, yeah, we had a brother div. And I'm like, what is a brother div? Because we never had that. And so they would start explaining, oh, you know, this half of the compartment, they would be on that half, we'd be on this half. And we were like, oh, no, we didn't have that. We didn't have that until our baby div arrived. And that was we could graduate, so we didn't care. So that was a, a plus. You get a compartment to yourself. And then um, another pro is, like, when you go to firefighting and stuff, normally you would be with your brother div, but we didn't have a brother div, so it would just be us. So we got to swimming quick. We got to firefighting quick. We, what else did we get to quick? The swimming, firefighting, the gas chamber, um, all the activities we did, um, Marlin Spike, everything, we got to quick because it wasn't, we didn't have a brother div to share that space with. It was just to ourselves. So I think that's a pro. Um, yeah. That was a, to me, that was a pro because I don't want to, that's too many people anyway. So. Yeah, if you have any other questions about 900 Divisions, please let me know. Um, it was awesome. I'm happy that I was in 900 Divisions. So let me know if you have any questions about it, and I will answer them for you. Again, thank you for watching my video.